Nova babes, my name is Jose, also known as Levidum Prince, and I am back again. This time I am back in the month of October. I am actually really excited to show you guys how I went ahead and created this super fun spider look using all Maven goodies. I would love to know what you guys' favorite spooky movies are. So yeah, don't forget to comment down below. And if you guys wanna go ahead and learn how to create this look, then keep on watching. As you can see, I started with my brows and base already done, so let's get right into this Halloween look. I'm going to start with the angled blush brush and go into shade Crush from the Maven Beauty 3D Cheek Powders. Using the shade Crush, apply the blush in an upward motion along your cheekbone all the way up to your temples. Using the leftover powder from the same brush, brush across your nose and face to warm up your face. After lining my lips, I'm going in with the Maybelline lipstick in shade Flex. Using the flat foundation brush, apply translucent powder to your lips to lock them in place. Now, using the Maybelline Beauty waterproof eyeliner in the black shade, I'm going to start working on the outer part of my lips to begin creating the spider. Start by creating a circle shape for the body. Add a second circle shape attached to the first one and fill both of them in. Going in with a small cream eyeshadow brush, pick up the black shade from the Basic Beat Defined palette. Tap the black shade onto your lips where you apply the black liner to set the liner. This step acts as a setting powder. Going back in with the black liner, I am going to start drawing the legs the first leg will be a line coming from the corner of my mouth, slightly angled down at the end. Repeat this step four times around the body of the spider. The legs on the inner portion will have more of a bent, like a 90 degree angled, giving the illusion the spider is crawling out of your mouth. Have fun with the lines, they don't have to be perfect. Once you complete the legs, repeat the setting powder step with the black shade from the defined palette. Next, we are going in with the pointed eyeliner brush and using the rose water setting spray, I am going to activate my white water based makeup paint. Picking up the white paint, you are going to make small lines around the spider to create highlights and dimensions so the spider can look 3D. Going back in with the lip brush, I'm picking up the black shade from the Basic Beat Defined Palette. I'm lightly applying the black shade around the legs to create a shadow behind the legs to make them really pop for the three-dimensional effect. Next, I'm going in with the eyeshadow smudge brush and the soft blend palette from Basic Beat. Picking up the lightest shade from the palette, I am going to add this in between the legs to make it pop even more. This step helps the shadow stand out. Now we are going to begin the spider on the eye. Going in with the blending brush and the brown shade from the defined palette, I am going to smoke out the outer corner and blend it across the crease. Going back in with the black waterproof Maven eyeliner, I am going to create a classic wink liner. Have fun with your liner and drag it out past the end of your brow for a dramatic effect. Repeat the same step on the other eye. Tip, you do not have to make the tip of the liner perfect so you can have a grungy look. With the same liner, you are going to start creating legs. Starting from the center of your lid, draw a line straight through your brow and angle it at the end like we did on the mouth. Don't be scared of the lines, they don't have to be perfect. We will set and blend later to add dimension. You are going to repeat the step of drawing legs from the liner through the brow four times. Using the detailed creased brush, pick up the black shade from the defined palette and smoke out the bottom waterline. Now that the bottom lash line has a base, we are going back in with the black liner to create the bottom legs. Starting with the inner corner, create a line with a 90 degree angle pointing towards the outside of your face. And do the same thing in the opposite direction on the outer corner of the eye. We want to get the illusion that the legs are grabbing onto your face. Going back in with the white paint and the pointed eyeliner brush, we are going to draw lines around the spider to create the highlights. Focus the white mainly on the bend of the legs to make them stand out. 
Don't forget to add some white to the wing to help it blend in with the rest of the spider legs. Using the lip brush, pick up the black shade from the defined palette. With this shade, we will begin creating shadow lines under the spider leg by lightly applying the eyeshadow. Just like on our lips, this step gives the spider a 3D effect. Add shadow under the wing as well to create the same dimension. To finish off the eyes, we are popping on the Maybelline Lashes at number 11. These lashes are wispy and beautiful. You can wear just one beautifully or you can stack them for a more dramatic effect. To seal the final look, spray your face with the rose water setting spray to make it last all night. All right, you guys, so this concludes this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as I did. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Happy Halloween.